using the Canvas background tab. Canvas is like a working desk of your presentation. You can insert and organize different elements inside Canvas. There is a dynamic grid on the Canvas so that guides users to place the objects more accurately. The Canvas can be zoomed in and out by scrolling the mouse or pinching in and out with fingers on the touch screen. The grid size will be adjusted accordingly to keep the precision level the same for all scales. The canvas has white color as default, but you can customize it based on your plan. To do so, from the right panel, choose background tab. From here, choose background color 1. A window will be displayed and from there, choose any color you want. We choose red. After clicking on OK, the whole background turns to red. Sometimes we don't want a single color for the background. This is the place we can choose the second background color. By choosing second background color, a gradient color will be created out of first and second background colors. But before seeing the effect, we should choose one of the gradient types from the background tab. Also, you can have a background picture over the gradient back color to give more visual effect to background. To do so, choose background image and you will see the background will be stretched over the background with full opacity. You can give more transparency by changing the corresponding slider. Besides, you can simulate the parallax effect on the background image by clicking the parallax checkbox. The parallax effect moves objects with different distances to observer so that gives depth of perception. Besides, you can create a frame over all the elements. This frame can be transparent in center and solid on sides. By doing so, presenter can filter out the objects surrounding the main subject and attract the focus of listeners to the central topic. Finally, you can create an identity card for your presentation from this tab. The identity card consists of an image and a text. The image can be image of your company or yourself. The text should be an informative message about presenter and presentation. To enable the identity card, one can select the enable checkbox from the ID card frame and then browse the desirable image for the left hand side frame. Finally, the ID card displays the page number under inserted text in your presentation automatically.